Hey guys, it's Tiffany from supereasymath.com. Today we are going to calculate the circumference of this circle. So in order to calculate the circumference of the circle, you need to know the formula for circumference and it is C equals 2 pi R or circumference equals 2 pi R. The pi stands for 3.14 and so on and we usually just write it as the symbol pi or you can write it as a 3.14 or you can write it as 22 over 7. So in this case, we're gonna, I'm gonna show you two different ways. We're gonna solve it when we put 3.14 in for pi, and then we're gonna solve it when we're just gonna leave pi as the symbol. So circumference equals two and pi, and then the R is the thing that I need to plug in, and I know that R stands for radius, so I can see from the problem that our radius is 15. So I'm gonna write 15. I'm not gonna write the centimeters because it's gonna make our problem look really cluttered, okay? So now I'm gonna multiply the two and the 15 because I can see that all of these numbers are supposed to be multiplied together. Whenever you see a whole bunch of different numbers or terms and there's no symbol in between, it means multiplication. So two times the 15 is the only thing that I can actually work out at the moment. So that becomes 30. So C equals 30 and I'm just gonna write the pi. So you can perfectly write down circumference equals 30 pi and that is the most absolute and complete answer and it's correct but if you did want to actually put in 3.14 for pi you would put c equals 2 3.14 and instead of r you're going to write your 15 so you have a value for everything that's up here and you're going to multiply your 2 times your 3.14 so i'm going to come over to the side of my paper or wherever i'm working and multiply that and I get eight, two, six, and my decimal would go right here because it went over two spaces because I had two spaces up here that I was working with. So that is C equals 6.28 times 15. Now I need to multiply the 6.28 by 15. When I do that, I'm gonna end up with 94.2 and now because I'm at the end and I don't have any other symbols to put on I will add the centimeters so cm right at the end for my final unit so your answer could be c equals 94.2 centimeters or you can put c equals 30 pi these have the same value in fact the one where the pi is written out as the symbol is more exact whenever you use 3.14 you're cutting off some of the value of pi so when you multiply you're getting a number that's sort of like an estimation. It's like a rounded answer. It's not exact as 30 pi written as a symbol. And let's take a sneak peek at tomorrow's math problem of the day. We have f of x equals 3x squared minus 4x plus 1. And they want us to plug in x plus 2 for our x value. So see if you can solve that now. And I'll come back tomorrow and answer it. Don't forget to head over to supereasymath.com if you need a live math tutor who you can talk to, ask questions for, and we'd be happy to pair you up with the tutor who's best fit for you. See you tomorrow.